I want to see a Star Wars Star Trek mashup called Dude. Trek Wars. I think that would make that would be an awesome episode where it's well, like uh, Kelvington uh, has done a Doctor Who Star Trek mashup DVD. It's pretty awesome. Really, where yeah. it looks like they're they're actually having a. Uh, a yeah, crossover. Where, he, yeah. where like they're they're having a real interaction. I have, I have the DVD around here somewhere. I thought it was an arm's length, but it's not. Oh, good. Uh, yes, thank you for getting more light on my shiny forehead. Uh, hey, Chad. Hey, I got to jump give me out a paper of here, towel. But have a good NSFW, man. <laughs> All right. Hey, have a good time. Uh, do you want do you want to hang around with us, Roger? Um, sure. I could probably hang out for like for twenty minutes or so. All right. Will you hang around as much or as little as you want? And we may. Uh, oh, good. While the camera's on, Roger, I'm gonna. Oh, and the sheen from my forehead. OMG, WTF, STFU, PWNED. Uh, that's awesome. You are a noob. L-M-A-O-R-O-T-F. And STF, shut the... Uh, KT, what, what's that bottom one? Oh, oh yeah, it says K, thanks, bye. K, thanks, bye. Love it, love it. Uh, Justin's looking more orange than usual. He's also chatting on his phone more often than usual. Roger has people to people to be and places to meet. Justin. Justin. There we go. Now we're showing him. I'm going to call him. I'm going to call him live on the air. We're joined live on the air. Oh, also, could you call Amtrekker? He should be. He should be. Uh... Is he not in the uh, is he not in the in between spaces between North and South America? Who? Amtrekker? Or no, I'm thinking of someone else. Hey. What was Am- yep. I think I'm thinking of someone else. My bad. Hey, what's going on? Who's who are you on the phone with? Oh, hey Brett, we're calling you right now. Okay, all right, I'm hanging up now. Uh he was on the phone with Brett, getting Brett ready. They're apparently making secret plans. And we'll explain what the what the shenanigan is here in just a bit. Oh, that's right. There was one other thing we needed to discuss that I just discovered. And we still can't. Hey, I guess, guys. Well, hey, they're up in the sky. It's Jury, the loud, hey, annoying guy. guy. Hey. Not on, folks. I remembered our one other, our one other item that we needed to discuss, our homework to do. What is that? Yeah, I want you in the room, ready to obey my every whim. Hey, are you excited about E three? Get your get yourself a get yourself be gone, sir. Uh, a uh, a microphone. Me? Yeah. Get yourself a microphone. Hey, you guys. Can I set mic level independently in Skype? Can I do that? Mic Probably. Of that? Pete Fick wants to know if I'm excited about the Breaking Bad finale. Very, very excited. Will not watch it until I see it with my lovely, lovely lady at home. So whatever you do, don't text spoilers. Oh, Brian, please. See, please. that's why you always got to go there. You always got to make that happen. Whatever you do, don't send him every spoiler. Hey, could you, uh, could you try lowering that arm? Because it's... Uh, I look like I'm holding it right there. Yeah, there you go. That's funny. Is this this is this isn't silly beast meets best, right? Eat, eats meets best. Yeah, but we do have Roger Chang who's going to hang around for a bit because he's got some inside knowledge. We can hit him up. You can ask him whether inside or not your trials knowledge. are correct or not because he he has experience covering E3. Oh, good. All right. Well, we've got some really great titles for you, Brian. Okay, great. Um, yeah, I, well, basically, I Roger, what, what we're doing here is we're going to prepare so, uh, our, our young squire okay, cool. for battle tomorrow by um, putting him through a few paces, including a list of fake game names that he's going to have to BS synopsis for. Um, so, right. like, just in case he gets thrown some random thing, like, oh, God, did you hear about blank? He's able to fill on camera. Because when people, people don't want to hear... Oh, I haven't seen that yet. Dude, <laughs> they can do that at their house. Okay? They want people right. to tell them what's going on. Okay. This is going to end badly. It's as long as you don't do a Kentucky Colonel accent and defend the wrong person. Oh, no. 
correctly? <laughs> that was oh, Justin. Wait, wait a minute. Do you do, uh, does that to say that you don't uh, have a superlative record in in your defenses where you employ the boomerang defense, which you invent on the spot? <laughs> Is it your brilliant legal mind? We're, we're, he's speaking specifically of his ability to uh, to accidentally condemn his own client and then turn it around and then defend him. Because if you remember, more. as judge, you let him off I off want. the court. You let it's him like, off the hook. You know, are you are you trying to persecute your own client, or are you defending? <laughs> are you are you defending the accused? It's it's See, it's weird. Many I finally understood that the, you were just, you know, mistaken, so. You know what? I just got a spoiler. Somebody texted me a spoiler out of nowhere. It just says, they all die. That's So apparently oh, that's, no. if you wanted to know how Breaking Bad ends, they all die at the end. They are all dead. The Same way the Brady Bunch ended. There's always a waiting room for heaven. Hey, do we have a video to start things off with this go-around? Um... I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Is John's? I don't know if we have one. Normally, we like to start things off with a, a clever video. I'm sure the chat. The, in the Breaking Bad finale, they they said that New Mexico is purgatory. So so apparently that's how it ends. Also, the same way the Brady Bunch ended. Actually, I don't know how. I don't remember how the Brady Bunch ended. I did remember that they ended up with Oliver, someone else's. Kid, like their nephew or cousin or something. Yes. Right. And then he killed everyone and announced that New Mexico was purgatory. I totally remember that episode. Yeah, no, it was great. I li- I love that. People are wondering where to have their chit chat if they want to join NSFW chat for NSFW chat. Join us over in Pound Unfiltered. If you just type slash join space pound unfiltered. We got some requests for Tom's beard relax. Pound unfiltered. That makes it sound like there should be some sort of drink that we invent called unfiltered, doesn't it? You need to pound them. Yeah. We should get sponsored by unfiltered wheat. <laughs> the hell's that? Unfiltered wheat beer? You've never had that? It you tastes like you're drinking oatmeal. Or not oatmeal, but uh, wheat. Yeah. <laughs> wheat germ <laughs> brand. If drinking only you wheat. could combine it with... Actually, do you know if the wheat that they use to uh, make certain beers is genetically modified? I've always been curious about that. Uh, I'm sure it is. Is it is it possible that it isn't? Do they grow wheat that isn't genetically modified anymore? Isn't that the whole reason we still have wheat and not little red spore covered husks? Vuvuzela, somebody sent us the legendary horn. Oh wow! I don't like it. You guys heard that, right? Yes. <laughs> oh my God! The boy, the boy, your man could smell like. All right, this looks legendary. Yes, go to uh, do a search for this is the boy your man could smell <laughs> could smell like. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. All right, uh, we'll show this. We'll show this. Out of nowhere, Chad saves the day. And do you have a? Do you have the, the, the go time sneak attack music? You don't? Uh, wait, uh, dun, somebody doesn't? Dun, 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 oh. do, do. Tony would say, I know where it is. Is Tony there? Is Tony look? He's there? working. He's doing other things for other people. You know what I got to say situations. to Tony? Blow me! <laughs> oh no, is that your new, is that your new Leo soundbite? Well, I don't know where that came from. <laughs> Jesus. Leo Laporte, come on. Why is Blow that? me. <laughs> Vicario, yes, that's the one. Stop hey, about my Vicario. Act, All right, so here's what I'll do. You you start this uh the the YouTube video. And right when we get the end, you play that music and I start talking and then we rock. End scene. Can you handle it? Well, that's all right. Then just, yeah, then just pop them out of full screen. And everyone will be like, wow, I'm so glad to get the behind the scenes mojo on how normally this show's so professional, but how kind that they're letting me see behind the veil. My forehead is still shiny. My forehead is naturally shiny, people. I could put uh, oatmeal on my forehead, look like I have a bit of a disease, a skin condition. 
Or I could have the shiny the, skin condition. Or I could have the the shininess of the ages. <laughs> wow, look at that. Chat room already has the theme music queued up. What theme music? All right, hit play on this thing whenever you're ready, sir. Are you talking about me? No. I'm talking to Jammer B, who's going to jam the bees. The bees knees. Bees, 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 bees. <laughs> the boy your man could smell like. Hello, ladies. Yeah.